Do you want to grow spiritually at like twice the speed? <laughs> this is Vince Miller. Today, our text is going to be from 1 Timothy chapter 6, verses 11 through 12. It reads, But as for you, Timothy, O man of God, flee these things. Pursue righteousness and godliness, faith, love, steadfastness, gentleness. So right at this moment, Paul has just told Timothy to watch out for bad teaching and bad teachers who desire deceptive gains. And now he gives him this command to flee or run away from these people and their teaching. But then Paul adds a counter action here. It's not only a command to flee from bad action and bad people and bad teaching, but a simultaneous pursuit of good action. And this is the thing that I think many men get wrong. They try to merely stop something without starting something new. And this is important because spiritual momentum never remains neutral. If you want to stop doing something, well, you got to run from it, and then you have to start something new. It's a stop with a start. It's a flee with a pursuit. I always think of it like two cars passing each other on a narrow stretch of road traveling at high speed. We flee one thing at 100 miles an hour and pursue another at 100 miles an hour. But as we pass, we increase our distance from each other at 200 miles an hour. <laughs> that thing in the rear view mirror is getting further from us at twice the speed because we're pursuing something new. So what does Paul tell Timothy to pursue? Well, six things that were going to be very important for him. First, righteousness or proper conduct toward others. Number two, godliness or obedience to God. Number three, faith or complete trust in God. Number four, love or benevolence toward people. Number five, steadfastness or staying power. And sixth, gentleness or being mild in manner with challenging people. So maybe there is something you need to stop doing. If so, run from it, flee from it, but simultaneously determine what you need to start doing. Once you decide what that is, pursue it. And if you do, you will watch your spiritual growth and fortitude increase at twice the speed. You can visit me at vincemiller.com and live all in for him. Who lived all in for you?